They're gone. Hello everyone, what is going on and welcome back to my channel for another video today. Now in today's video I've got another gameplay for you today and the gameplay what's going to be in today's video is going to be, um, I was using a somewhat considered competitive class in a public match. Now what I mean by that is um, I've been watching the CWL recently, like, I'm not that clued up about it but I was watching it because there was nothing really on and I was kind of bored with the game and other things like that so I decided to watch a bit of CWL. And we obviously have a lot of different class setups, sorry about my phone, we obviously have a lot of different class setups compared to what pub, uh, public match players use because you don't really, you obviously can't use scavenger, LMG, stuff like that, like, there's just a lot of things what are not used in competitive, what I don't really use in pubs, like, I don't really use comp class setups, so I thought I'd back one on and give it a try. Now, I was using the standard AR setup, which is um, double quick draw, stock, and elo, or reflex, that kind of just depends on the preference of a player, but I prefer elo over the reflex, so I put that on. And I was using obviously scavenger because it is a pub, not a competitive match. But for the most part, the weapon is mainly what I was trying to test out. Like, is a weapon what is good in competitive also good in public match? Like, kind of hang. Like, normally I'd put fast mags on my Maddox, but obviously you don't really need fast mags in a search and destroy game. So I thought, well, we would like. Is it possible to play about fast mags? Because I'm, I'm a fast player. Obviously, I'm always reloading. I'm always getting into gunfights. So I thought uh, at first that I wouldn't be able to deal with it. And I'd be like, find myself always out of ammo and stuff. But I actually did fairly well. I got three nuclears on the day of recording this. And two of them was, was with this class. Out of them. The other was with my uh, trusty Vapor class. Now, for the perks, I was using Scavenger, Gung Ho, and I believe Team Link. And I meant to actually put Dead Silence on, but I put on the wrong perk but dead silence is what I would normally have. Now as you can see in this gameplay I'm kinda of beaming kids with this. Like it seems really accurate. I don't know if it was the lobbies we were in or whatever but the hit detection seemed really really clean in this lobby. Like the bullets I was shooting was actually hitting people which is less than I can normally say for this game because this game has terrible hit detection because there's bullet travel time in this game rather than just a simple hit scan like every other Call of Duty game ever. So you know there is um Obviously, if, if you're a long time so man, you know I complain, complain about this game all the fucking time. But today, to be fair, the day of actually me getting this gameplay, it wasn't even that bad, it was kind of fun. Now, I just want to like touch up on things like, I don't know if it's YouTube itself or my videos and everyone else's videos, which would be obviously a very big coincidence, but for people who are sub to and I watch a lot, I don't want to name names because I don't want to like seem hostile, but I'm, I've, I've noticed a lot of people who are watchers like videos, like their views seem to be really on the down low, and I can say the same for me, like normally I can pretty much guarantee my video to hit 100 views on the night it's released and then maybe surpass anywhere from about 150 to 200 within a few coming days. Now I'm not saying like you're a b I don't want it to come across as if I'm like annoyed or anything, it's just like are you guys getting bored with my videos, are you guys getting bored with seeing Black Ops 4 gameplay because I know a lot of you guys subbed through Infinite Warfare and Black Ops 3 so would you like to see me go back to that game because honestly I obviously I as much as I complain about this game, I do kind of enjoy it when I get the right lobby, but you guys know I love Infinite Warfare and BO3, and if if you just want to see Infinite Warfare and Black Ops 3 videos, I'll do my, I'll do my best to try and get gameplays on them games. If it's going to bring you more enjoyment, me more enjoyment, and it's going to bring more views, then it's a win-win-win situation, in my opinion. But obviously I'll continue to do BO4, but I just I just noticed that mine and a lot of other content creators who I watch videos were a lot lower in views recently compared to what they normally should be. Now, having said that, I just, want to, just wanted to get that off my chest. I want to ask you that question. So, thank you so much for watching this video, if you uh, didn't make it this far. Thank you, uh, just comment, like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys are new here, it would be massively appreciated. And I'm seeing you in the next one. Please enjoy the rest of the gameplay, and peace.